Oh, it's a wonderful solution. We've had uh, we've had a lot of luck. We've had some wonderful au pairs. Um, they have done wonderful things with our children, uh, and we always seem to get what we need at the time. You know, since the children have started in school, we've had some au pairs that have been absolutely wonderful about getting the kids home, getting them to start their homework, getting it done. Um, you know, they're very firm about it, but have been very, very kind and loving about it too, so that it doesn't become a chore. Uh, they just, they just seem to find the right knack for, for moving them in the right direction, getting things done. And, and yeah, for the au pairs too, it's, it's, it seems like a nice arrangement because it's a chance for them to, um, you know, we don't, we, we treat them as grown ups, and we don't try to tell them what to do and what not to do. But it's a chance to be out on their own, but they have the comfort of having a second family there to look out for them. He's a part of our family first and then she's an old parent. Right. She should leave here feeling that she's always part of our family after she leaves. Mm -hmm. That's enough. You know? and I think that in itself, mm -hmm. she will have enveloped and, and digested everything about us and our country and our culture to have that feeling. Mm -hmm. And just to experience different places. I mean, we travel a lot within New England and Maine, New Hampshire, and I think that would be great for her. And it's not, you know, the process that we've experienced here is it's not only a help for us, which is big, I think it's just as important it's helping that au pair, that, mm -hmm. that person. Right. Well, there's some, you know, requirements that she has to, to in the English part of it, or some of the exams she wants to study for, but uh, to me that's a great component attaching that requirement for that person when they're coming here. It gives focus and attention on the right things. Mm -hmm. So that to me was important. And, um, I hope that the relationship doesn't end at the end of a year, you know, and uh, someday maybe we can reciprocate and, you know, go there. So mm -hmm. I think from the children's perspective, uh, um, she'll always be part of their, their, their life, mm -hmm. you know, and, and hopefully the the feelings are mutual because the separation anxiety is almost there. You feel for the children. I I, I feel it now for them. Yeah. It's it's just I think it will be the best year of my life. Until now, it's my the best decision I've ever taken. I think it just makes me grow up. I can imagine how my mom felt with me. That's how I feel with them. You get you learn to be very tolerant. Definitely, you have. You learn to be patient with the children a lot, and um, you learn to be attentive. You learn a lot that you can use later in your work, and just to be part of a new group, because they are not like your family, you have to realize that. You learn just to, to fit in that, and that's important. You need that in a job everywhere. When you deal with other people, with foreign people, that's what I learned from that, I think.